this video is to walk you through creating your very own VIP group or customer group, whatever you want to call it. So you basically um, use this left tab over here. You can, there's a couple of different ways on how you can get here, but this is the easiest and simplest way. Just on your left um, menu bar, sidebar, click on groups. And this will bring up a list of all the groups that you're in. But if you notice towards the right, up top, um, this green icon that says create group, create your group there. And then give your group a name. So we can do um, Teamu's Pure Romance VIPs. And then you are uh, in order to create the group you always have to add someone for me I have another page and so that can be my person if you guys need someone um, you can always add me to your groups I don't mind um, and then you always want to make it a closed group because if you see anyone can find a group and see who's in it only members can see the post so um, once you create your group you have a, a link and I'll show you that and you'll be able to use that link to like you can post it everywhere people can click the link and request to join your group and then um you can approve them in but if you do um if you do public then you know anybody can see all your posts and because we're in the romance industry you want to make sure that there is some privacy component to it so you don't want everybody seeing what goes on in the group you know um and, but if you do secret then nobody can find the group even if you share the the url it will not come up they won't be able to click um and you'll have to physically add them into the group and you know how people you may even yourself hate just randomly being added to groups without even like a heads up or dang you could have asked me permission so closed group is going to be your best option for that and then you definitely want to pin it to your shortcut so it's easy to find so pin to shortcuts create and then you can select the icon um, I like the wine glass or you can do there was here's a heart but it's like a broken heart so we don't want to think of broken hearts um, but for now I'm just going to choose the wine glass <clears throat> because you know ladies nights fun party wine all go together right so click OK And then you want to choose a photo. So upload photo. And I posted um, some, I posted these exact images right in our team group. These might not be the exact size. Oh, it fit perfectly. So there you have it. Save changes. And this is really good because Flirt with Adventure, it kind of goes with the summertime. There's our really sexy flirt perfume. Um, and it's a a nice is nice and bright and eye-catching so this group is created voila I have my one member in there I have my cover image and then if you go to manage group you can see oh wait these three ellipses here go click on that and do edit group settings so there's our name you can pick a group type here which can be you can do club um, you can do, I wouldn't do team, you can do custom if you want it, but just, you know, club is fine. And click that, and then you can do a description. So your description, um, you might want to go over, um, let's see, just something right off the, the cuff. Um, welcome to my VIP customer group. Um, you'll be you'll be the first to learn about new product releases, um, sales, giveaways, and everything pure romance. And everything hmm. 
You'll be the first to learn about new product releases, sales, giveaways, and everything Pure Romance by Tayamo. Whatever, you can go back and change it later. I don't have tags in mine, um, and then I don't think I have a location in mine either. You can if you want to. Here's where you can customize the, the address. So like my VIP group is PR by Tayamo's Divas. PR by Tayamo Divas, because my group is Romance Divas. So you can do whatever you want. I'm not going to customize this because I'm going to end up deleting this group. I'm just using it as an example. So you can customize it. So um, you can do um, like Lorraine's VIP or um, Lorraine, you know, whatever you want customize it that way it's easy for you to remember and you don't have to worry about going to the group copying it and then pasting it you can just type it right out because you remember it here's where you can change your privacies but if you have it as closed group leave it as closed group and then i highly recommend that any you select this second option here under membership approval any member can add members but an admin or moderator must approve them this way um you have the ability to approve who's in your group especially if you have members that are just adding all of their friends um i once i learned better i let my members know don't just add your friends you know make sure that you ask some permission first and when all else fails just give them the link you know i always tell them give them the link let them request to join themselves but the really cool thing that we now have is this membership request area so you can put questions here so uh, one question could be how did you hear about this group this way they can answer like i didn't i was at it and then you know like okay you know um and then you can ask them have you ever attended or hosted a pure romance party before that way if they if they say no they don't know much about pure romance and that can give you a way you can private message them and you know let them know kind of start building that relationship you don't need three questions um but the third question i would say um would you like more information on how to get a free shopping spree you want to make the questions very easy that they can either answer yes or no or a short answer um you see they'll have up to 250 characters to answer each one so you want to make it very short and sweet and then you can click save and then update your member approved your questions have been saved please select how new members can be added and approved again leave it on a second option okay all group posts must be approved by an admin i have mine i have this checked in my group because sometimes you get um the spam box and they'll start spamming anything or if you get someone um maybe that's hosted a party for you before and they now have their own direct sales business that's not pure romance they may go in your group and plug their business you know and now your clientele is going to make purchases from them. So I have mine check on all posts must be approved just because I need to, my group is not that big where it's overwhelming for me to, um, to moderate the post. So you wanna save that. Um, so everything's saved there and your group is good to go.